A small force of Allied infantry with armored support overran and held the German garrison and the airstrip they were occupying. German film captured in the raid allows us the opportunity to show both sides of the battle as it occurred. Awaiting orders, the force keeps a close eye on any possible movement by the enemy. The enemy prepares to defend the airstrip against attack. They send up a small observation plane. Oh no, they've been spotted. It's time to attack. With the German position in sight, our boys press the attack with everything they've got. And the Germans are equally determined to hold the airstrip at all costs. The enemy have called in air support. The tank's been hit and put out of action. Luckily, the crew's okay, and the 450s on the half track have convinced the Stuka pilot that it's time to leave. As British Prime Minister Winston Churchill has said, the discussion is continued. Our boys are getting closer to their objective. They are going to silence that machine gun nest. And the Allies are once again victorious. They have taken the airstrip and a number of German prisoners in the bargain. It's another step on the road to crushing Adolf Hitler and the Third Reich.